If you want to plot a graph using sheets, what you need to do is double click on it and then you get this menu here. If you go to the setup section, you can choose the X axis and the Y axis with these two different menus. In this case, what we want to do is have one over the volume along the X axis, which in this case is already set to E5 through E13. But if I didn't have that, what I'd do is I would delete it click on this and then highlight the range I want. To set the Y axis, I click on these three dots. I'm going to re remove this one. I click on add series, this little grid here, click in here to activate that. And then I choose the frequency data. I now have both axes plotting together. To add additional things to the data, what I need to do is go to the customize section and have a look through the various menus here. First of all, for access titles, I can go into here and then I can type in whatever my title might be. In this case, it's going to be one over the volume. I can then go into the other one for vertical and I can type in what I need there. For the title, it's best to give a title that's something other than what the axis are. And so on. The other things you need to be able to do is you need to go to the horizontal axis section and you might need to change the minimum and maximum values. Here in this case it's plotting quite well. The key thing is it goes through zero almost all the time. You might choose to change various things here but I'll leave them alone for now. The next thing might be the vertical axis and it's a similar idea. The last thing is the grid lines. We want minor grid lines in addition to the major ones in both directions. So that's the vertical and that's the horizontal.